Drivers are dealing with some pretty rough roads in Tippecanoe County, but the winter road damage is catching more than drivers off guard. News 18 Samantha Tiki joins us now live with more on how the Tippecanoe County Highway Department is trying to repair a record amount of winter road damage. Sam? Well, Jeff and Gina, the roads were frozen most of the winter, and the recent thaw has caused damage to a lot of the roads out here in Tippecanoe County. But these aren't your typical potholes. Now, just to give you an example of how bad the roads are, they've actually started crumbling and cracking in places, adding to what Tippecanoe County Highway officials said is some of the worst winter road damage they've seen in decades. It's disintegrating pretty bad out there, but you really have to watch where you're going because if not, you could probably lose a tie or something. Tippecanoe County Highway Department Director Opal Kuehl says roads are a little worse for wear than usual this spring. All of the frost just seemed to come out of the ground about the same time. So instead of having a pothole in one area, a whole section of the roadway would crumble and break up. Kuehl says the highway department always budgets for patching, but she says the amount of repairs needed caught them off guard. I think it's just the quantity. We know we have so many more than we've had in the past. And there's money in our budget for repairs. And so we can do some of those repairs, but it's going to be far more than we'd anticipated. And far more money to be spent repairing all of the damage. I'm sure it's going to be at least a couple hundred thousand dollars, if not more than that, just, just for these repairs. Kuehl says their budget consists of $1 million from the wheel tax and another $1 million from the county council. But she says the repairs could come at the cost of other county road projects. The more patching and, and temporary work we have to do to get these roads back in shape, then the less we're going to be able to resurface other roads that we wanted to resurface later in the summer. But more money could be provided for repairs. Kuehl took Tippecanoe County commissioners to areas with severe damage Thursday afternoon. She says if the commissioners think the damage is bad enough, more money could be allotted to make more repairs. Kuehl says regardless of their decision, the repairs will be made. Be patient. We are going to get around um, to all of them and get the repairs made, but it's just going to take a lot longer than it normally would for us. Kuehl says the county highway department has been making temporary repairs until hot asphalt is available. She says that could be available as early as ne next week, allowing them to begin making repairs to the county roads. Now, if anyone sees or comes across roads that are damaged, Kuehl says you're encouraged to report it to the Tippecanoe County Highway Department. Reporting live in Tippecanoe County tonight, Samantha Tiki, News 18.